Hi, Larry Gaines, PowerCycleTrading.com. A big part of your trading success really comes from selecting really good trades. So if you look back at the great trades that you've had, you probably say, wow, I wish I could find these trades over and over. And one of the ways to do it is kind of look for a repeatable process. And so one step that I use is to have a watch list of potentially breakout trades. So here's my scanner, and I've got a few things I'll point out that you can add to your watch list if you like. So one is Pepsi. This has been in a squeeze for 61 days. So potential for a big breakout here. That's that's one. Another one that looks really interesting is Dollar General. It's been in a squeeze for 28 days. Uh, another one that looks really interesting here is Boeing. It's been in a squeeze for 16 days. And then Zoom, been in a squeeze for 10 days. Uh, and those are the primary ones that I wanted to show you. And one more is Autodesk, if I can find it right here. Autodesk, 13 days. So let's take a look. So I'm going to link these to my charts and I'm going to click on them and you'll see right away the pattern and the volatility squeeze that we're talking about. Now the first, the first one here is Pepsi. Okay, so you can see here this is my indicator that can mark and show me on one chart the various time frames in a squeeze so it's 10 minutes in a squeeze daily two day three day four day and the top row shows the momentum if it's red it's it's negative and if it's positive it's green all right so first off you can see here it's got a squeeze on the daily two day three day four day so potential for a massive break either up or down so here's what it looks like on the daily chart here's the daily squeeze and then two day so this is really really coiling big potential to see if it can trigger and right now momentum is showing it potentially the probable direction to the upside another one here is dollar general so very similar to pepsi you can see look at all the multiple squeezes here two minute uh 50 15, 20, 60, two hour daily, two day, three day, four day. So massive amount of squeezes. So now let's take a look at the daily two day. So very, very similar again to Pepsi. You can see here this daily squeeze and the two day squeeze. So this one is, is one to add to your watch list with potential probable direction right now to the upside. Another one is Autodesk. So in the middle, and these are all different. These are all stocks that have already had their earnings. So you don't have to worry about that. So Autodesk is in the middle of the range and a big squeeze here uh, for the daily time frame. So it also has a two, a daily and a two day squeeze. So, so this is one I'm watching for either, this could go either way, break lower or break up. So Autodesk and the next one is Zoom. All right, so Zoom is in a, a very very nice squeeze here also on the daily time frame, And you can see it's got a 20 minute, 30 minute, two hour and daily squeeze here. So in the middle of the range, not quite giving us a, a direction as to where it wants to go for the breakout, but this is one I'm watching. And then one more here that looks really poise is potentially for a break to the downside and that's on Boeing which just had its earnings today. So you can see Boeing here has this massive volatility squeeze on the daily and this is what I call a cliffhanger. It's right down to key major support right here at 165. This breaks it's got good potential room down to easily to 155. And uh, if you'd like to learn more about these price directional types trades for reversals and breakouts and then the option strategies to use make sure to join me this Saturday. I'll be doing an option boot camp uh, actually a directional trading boot camp using options and that's going to be this Saturday. It's going to be a fantastic course so make sure to check out the details and bonuses and hopefully I'll see you there. Good luck trading.